We started the year off and we had no idea um, where we were going to be. You know, we lost some of our good, good players, but we retained a lot of our good players. Nobody gave us a chance. I don't even know if we really believed in ourselves uh, the first couple weeks of the season. And I'd say we were probably an average high school hockey team uh, for the first half of the year. But LV really believed in us and, and we found that belief within each other and we became a really resilient group. As the season went on, we, we kind of had this feeling that it was going to be a really good year. You know, we had a lot of really strong young players who, you know, came out and really overwhelmed the team. We got to sectionals, one sectionals again. We're like, oh, well, this is, you know, good. We did this all last year. And it's like, we just, it sort of was like a feeling of like, we shouldn't be here, but we should be here. And, you know, every game that we won, it just got easier. And we just had, literally, it was just like, Everyone had more and more fun and everyone was smiles all the time. We just stuck together and by the end of the year, nobody was going to beat us. And I think, you know, that showed winning, I think, what, 5-1, 7-2 in the state championship. And I think it's a testament to the group of guys we had in the locker room and the leaders we had on our team and, and uh, definitely to Al Weiberg. Uh, he did an amazing job with our team. Couldn't ask for a better uh, support group from everyone. We're all on the same page, won the same finished product, which was a state championship. None of us, I don't think, thought we were gonna do it coming into the season, but as time went on, we just kept getting better and better in practice, working hard, started to believe in ourselves, and I think that was a product of just all the guys on our team being great guys, um, and that showed on and off the ice. I'm really proud to have been a part of this team, I think even more so than I've ever been knowing that, you know, we're going into the Hall of Fame and all. But being the youngest team, it's just, it's really made me rethink my, my perspective on this team and how I look back on those memories. I think that they're, they're even more validated now. I'm starting to realize its real place in, you know, the sporting history of McQuaid and the hockey program itself.